The stage is set for the NCAA Final Four. The men's and women's teams are gearing up for their next do-or-die matchups. It'll be a jam-packed weekend on the hardwood with each team hoping to get one step closer to the big dance. The men's teams get started tomorrow, but the women's Final Four kicks things off tonight. And joining us now is ESPN and ACC Network analyst Muffet McGraw at the stadium in Cleveland, Ohio, where the women's teams will face off. Thanks so much for being with Good us. Good to see you, Muffet. Good afternoon. Pleasure to be here. So uh, you know a thing or two about winning a national championship. You've won a few. <laughs> what can we expect to see from those women's teams tonight? Well, I can tell you this. It's a lot less stressful on this side, <laughs> not knowing what's going to happen. This is going to be the most exciting Final Four. Last year, we set records just under 10 million viewers. This year, we've already had 12 million watch one of the games leading wow. up to this. All eyes are on Caitlin Clark. She is phenomenal, and she is the one leading this charge. But all four teams coming at it from different directions. South Carolina, obviously the favorite, but everybody's got a great chance of winning. And let's talk about Caitlin Clark. She has proven that she is the one to beat. So how does she keep that momentum going? She hasn't had any trouble so far. I think I'm a little surprised with the weight of what she's been carrying for this team. She's really got to be the one that has to do everything. All eyes are on her. The defense is keying on her. Everybody is expecting big things from her, and she continually delivers and makes this the most exciting game, coming off a 40-point game in her last game. I'm sure Connecticut's going to look to do something to slow her down tonight. And I do love watching Clayton play basketball, but I have to admit, I'm a South Carolina alumni, so <laughs> I'm cheering for the game. Feeling some kind of way. Yeah, yeah, I, ha I have to, I have to, you know. Anyways, it's been a huge, big year for women's basketball. So the ticket sales have been incredible. When you look at where women's basketball has come, what goes through your head? It's amazing how far we've come. We, we've grown incrementally, but I think when we had that debacle with the NCAA where the women's tournament was clearly being treated not as well as the men, I think since then, all eyes have been on what the women are doing. There's great players. There's exciting players to watch. Every game, we've had sellouts across the country throughout this regular season. People really love the women's game. A lot of it is because the attention that Caitlin Clark is getting. But you're right about South Carolina. They are the team to beat. Dawn Staley has done so much to build the attendance and the following that they have. All of these teams are coming from great cultures, great crowds, and they're going to have a lot of fans here tonight. All right, let's talk about the men's tournament. North Carolina State on a Cinderella run. How will they stack up against Purdue? How exciting to have both NC State teams, one in the women's Final Four and one in the men's. It's a shame they've got to choose whether to go to Phoenix or Cleveland, but this is going to be an exciting game. Definitely the Cinderella team in the tournament. Kevin Keyes has done a phenomenal job with this team. They just are the hottest team, I think, in the game right now, but they've got to go up against Purdue and Zach Eady, and he is one tough player to stop. UConn, they're going for back-to-back -back titles. This is their hope, right? They've been on quite the run. Mm -hmm. Do you think they're the team to beat? Definitely, they are coming in as the overall number one favorite, similar to South Carolina on the women's side. They definitely have the edge. Well, Muffet, we will all be watching it again. Thank you for joining us. We appreciate it. Always good to see you. You bet. Thank you. You are welcome. And you can catch the women's final four games on ESPN tonight. We'll all be watching. Go Gamecocks. <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.